Hey guys, Ryan here. Today we are going to be reacting to The Last of Us, Season 1, Episode 7, entitled, what is it called? Left Behind. So, God knows what this episode's going to have in store for us, because I didn't expect the last episode to end with Joel stabbed, alive, dead, not quite sure. Um, but yeah, that's kind of where we're at right now. Um, we got to meet up with Tommy. Joel's brother, we got to see his wife, Maria, she's pregnant, they have this nice little community, um, but now Joel and Ellie are still, you know, going out to try to find the cure for the apocalypse, because she's immune, but, yeah, I'm kind of hoping this episode will pick up the pace a little bit, because the last one was a little slow, in my opinion, still a good episode, though, I, re I went back and I was editing the episode, or the reaction, and it was actually, I was like, okay, this is better than I remember, um, because I liked, I really liked the introduction of Maria's character, I really liked their community, and, like, the cowboy sort of aspect of it, um, and I love that they're in Wyoming, I, I kind of wish that, like, the place, or this show had a permanent setting, almost, because it is kind of all over the place, which isn't a bad thing, but I love when they have, like, I, basically what I'm trying to say is, I hope at the end of this show they go back, or, I mean, not at the end of the show, but whenever they have this cure figured out, they go back to Wyoming with Tommy and Maria and all of them all of those people because I just, I love when they have like a community that they want to, like they live there and they love it. Um, but obviously they don't, we can't do that right now. They have other things to, they have other fish to fry that are much more important. Um, cause they are trying to save the world. So kind of disregard what I said because I don't know. Anyways, um, I'm really excited to get into this episode and see what's going to happen because we only have three episodes left. Um, so yeah, let's get into this episode. Oh, Jesus. Oh, she's definitely dragging him on, like, a sled. Or something. Ooh. Oh, he's still here. Good. Leave. Leave. Shut up, John. I genuinely don't know what they're gonna do. Like, actually, what are they gonna do? North. Go to Tommy. By herself? That's like five days away. On horse. Well, I guess they do still have the fucking horse, duh. I mean, the episode is called Left Behind, too, so I'm a little scared she is going to leave him behind. I just, I don't know if she can do it, though. I really don't. I doubt she has the heart to leave him behind. Like, she's too good. Or... Maybe she does, because she does seem to be doing that right now. No way. Ain't no way that she is leaving him behind. The hell? Literally, what is going on? So she left him behind, and now she's a part of this, like... Oh! Give him back! I'm not running doubles again because of your shitty attitude. Okay, f this bitch. You don't fight. Just your friend fights. She's not here anymore. I'm gonna need a rundown because I seem to have missed like four episodes or something. Oh! Where is she? What? Well, Bethany's in the infirmary with 15 stitches. Good. Okay. Oh. Just put me in the fucking hole. Damn, I put Ellie. Me in the hole three times. It doesn't work. Or is this a flashback? We're the only thing holding this all together. If we go down, the people in this zone will starve or murder each other. That much I know. There's a leader in you. And one day it could be. I do agree with that. I do agree with that. Or not. Well, this is a flashback. Are we gonna see how she's had to kill someone before? Cause she did say that she's done it before. Or that she's had to hurt someone. I feel like Bethany's bitch ass is gonna try to come get her. And obviously that ain't gonna work. Yup. Oh shit. Mm, you're not that quiet, honey. Riley, oh. Why you oh my God. She's in euphoria. Why up on me like that? It was a joke. So they know each other. I thought you were dead. You've been gone for three weeks. I should fucking stab you. 
Are you okay? I'm fine. I just ran away for a bit, that's all. <laughs> I joined the Fireflies. Oh, fuck you. She's being serious. You're a Firefly? Jesus! I told you I'd fucking do it. Sort of crazy, and you're gonna say no, but then you have to say yes. Come with me for a few hours and have the best night of your life. No. Get dressed. So stupid. She was right. Gonna say no, and then you're just gonna follow exactly what she says. Guards? No. This Fetcher's fucking stupid. Ready? This better be good. I really like her already. Okay, you are being quite loud as shit. Oh god. Not that fucking I'm nervous. I'm nervous. You put Carol in the infirmary for a fucking week. I'm just saying, you can't fight everything and everyone. You can pick and choose what's important. Oh. Are they teaching you this at Firefly University? That's what I was thinking. She's changing now because she joined the Fireflies. Where are we going? Through a damn window. She wasn't kidding. I really like her, but I feel like Ellie following her isn't going to lead to anything good. How many floors? Uh, like two. Two floors, fuck you. I was a tag bit off. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, they have such a cute little oh, friendship. Oh, okay. So there's a dead person right there, awesome. No, this this guy wasn't here yesterday. Oh, Jesus. Oh, uh, I hate this. I really hate this. It's so disgusting. No, it's gonna be a jump scare and he's gonna start moving. Ah! This guy must have spent every card he had to get this. No one told him he couldn't mix pills with that shit? Or it's a setup and someone killed him. <laughs> Guys, I hate this. I don't know why this is scaring the shit out of me. Okay, you're drinking it or what? Yeah. That's stupid. Damn, sister. Can I hold your gun? They kind of made me swear not to let other people handle my sidearm. Not to handle my. Give me your gun. All right, fine. This is a bad idea. I'm like, I just had like a bad feeling about this episode. Like, I'm scared of what's gonna happen. Some firefly dude and was like, ah, oh, it's, it's cool. I think I'll be a terrorist. Yep, that's it. We're getting married. <laughs> I love her. One night, you were in the hole. I got bored, so I snuck out. And this chick popped out of nowhere. Chick like our age? No, like 40 or 50, whatever. Anyways, old. Oh, that's not even that old. That's like middle age. We're on a mission here. And what's this mission? I think whenever I watch an episode and like there's somebody in it and it's from the past, but that person isn't in the current episodes, I think that's why it gives me such a bad feeling because something has to happen to her. You know what I'm saying? Like, for us to have not seen her, she has to either die or get captured or something bad has to happen. We're here. The mall? You out of your fucking mind? They sealed that place off for a reason. It's full of infected. Why do they feel the need to be stupid? Like, can you just go to bed? Perhaps. Just go to bed. Don't break into a mall that is really full of infected that will kill you. And make all the noise in the world. We're gonna go through there, then turn right, we see a door, go through it, wait. Fine. Are you gonna kill me? This is weird. Why are you making her go by herself? Nope, I don't like this. I'm here now what Jesus of course her flashlight is now not working oh wow that's actually really cool but like how do people on the outside not see that or am I crazy that is actually really cool though especially in this world like that would be like monumental that'd be a core memory 
We're fine. You saw outside. It's like a big bunker. No one can see shit but us. I really wish I could believe that, but that is bright as hell. <laughs> she seems really sweet. When's she gonna die? Electric stairs? This is reminding me of Stranger Escalator. Things. <laughs> oh shit! Jesus, Ellie! No, I'm good. Oh, I forgot that they are drinking. They're def she's definitely drunk. I hate mannequins. Ooh. Stuff like that is just like mind blowing to me. Like back in five minutes, oh, they actually are probably dead now and never came back. Like. What was that about? What is it? Oh, wow. Oh my god, it works. No way. That's probably such a special moment. Like, they don't get much of this stuff in this world, if any at all, honestly. Nothing. You're drunk. No. Yes. Not yet. I think you're drunk, Ellie. <laughs> yeah. Oh geez, she's taking another one. Let me nope. see if I can fix it. Oh no. It didn't stop working because something went wrong. Someone else, someone did that. Like. That's when you get your assignment. You know what Quan gave me? Sewage detail. I'd rebel too. I wouldn't want to do that. A time machine. <laughs> oh, they're gonna do a photo booth. That's actually so cute. That one's oh. not bad. Thanks, almost out. Do you like it? It's yours. Oh. Wonders to see. Are we going to whatever number we're up to? They're not being very cautious of their surroundings, and I, I'm not loving that. Is that infected? Oh. Had me fooled. This also has, like, this just has, this does have to be one of the best nights of her life, honestly. She's never gotten to experience anything like this. Do you have any money? No, not that useless shit. Coins. <laughs> You asshole. I know everything is going so peaceful and great and she's making so many memories. I know I know this girl's gonna die. I know she's going to. Oh, oh. Fuck. That's kind of a good representation of the world now, right? Like they well I mean I can feel like these zombies are different. They still eat people, right? But like they eat you and then nothing is left but bones. Oh geez, what's it gonna show us? I'm scared. It's gonna show us something that I probably don't wanna see. I'm actually so scared right now, guys. Uh-uh. Oh my god. Oh Jesus Christ, no. No, this isn't good. This isn't good. Good thing she has a gun. Oh. Okay. I know they're kids, so I feel weird saying this, but am I crazy or is there like a little thing between them? Like a spark? Uh, it's getting late. I have to wake up and make my bed soon. We, we still have a few hours left though. Yeah, I, I just can't get in trouble again. I got you again. Oh. I mean... Oh, wait. Wait, is it tacos? You think the food here is going to be safe to eat after 20 years? Is this where you've been staying? Mostly. Volume 2. <gasps> Shut oh. up! <laughs> we made a second one? Oh, that's actually adorable. 
What did the frustrated cannibal do? Lay it on me. He threw up his hands. <laughs> <laughs> These are not that funny. I'm sorry. Do you call an alligator? An oh no, abyss? she's gonna find something. Are those bombs? Did you make these? Yes, Ellie, put it down. You didn't find this mall, did you? They posted you here. We would never use them on you or anywhere ever near you. I would never let them do that. You would never let them? No, I'm sorry, you think you're gonna listen to you? Yeah, you probably can't control that. I mean, I guess we'll find out. Ellie. It's okay, I'm going. Ellie! Bro, this is not good. This is so bad. None of this shit was even about me. Would you stop screaming? Oh my god, oh my god, I hate this. Ellie, I tried. Tonight's my last night in Boston. This is sad and all, but I'm only worried about that infected that's just gonna come out of nowhere probably and kill her. This isn't easy, Ellie. It actually is. You just did it. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. They didn't show that infected for nothing. Something is gonna happen. Something's gotta happen. I beg them something to happen. I need something to be spiced up right now. God, I'm scared she's gonna go back and she's gonna be dead. Riley? Oh, Jesus, no. What the oh. fuck? Are you kidding right now? Oh my god, I actually like this. <laughs> I don't know what it was like to have a family. To my mom. And I want that again. Maybe the fireflies aren't what I think they are, but they chose me. I matter to them. Do you? Are you sure about this? About leaving? I don't blame her. I wouldn't want to pick up or watch other people pick up shit and be like, on guard with it. And I'll miss you. This is a nice special moment, but something is gonna go wrong, like I know it. Nate's not over yet. Right now. I'm scared. I don't even know. I keep thinking something bad's gonna happen and then nothing happens, so. Uh-huh. They are being louder than loud right now. Oh yeah, and cover up your face so you don't have peripheral vision. Oh, this is the worst. This just is not gonna be good. Oh. <laughs> yep. Yep. Oh, I hate this. They don't teach you how to shoot as a firefly, I guess. Oh, oh, oh. Anywhere but there, like the head. Jesus. Yep, she's gonna die. She's totally scratched or something. I hated that. What's wrong with her? Oh, it's her. But like, she's fine, obviously. I mean. No, 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 no! Oh. I just got chills. Oh my god, her acting was so good. <gasps> they both did. But Ellie's not. Nothing's gonna happen to Ellie. Oh my god. Oh, finally, we're seeing this again. I really want to know what's going on with Joel. Yeah, she's not going to leave him. Opens the see-through cabinet that is empty. The way I see it, we got two options. We take the easy way out. No, I don't like option one. Option two. We just keep going. Thankfully, Ellie did that because... They could just be all poetic and shit and lose our minds together. What's option three? 
Is there an option three? That's heartbreaking. I genuinely don't know if, like, if I lived in this world, how I would just be able to process, like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna die. Like, I know that happens in our world, too, but, like, getting bit by a literal zombie and you're just like, I'm, I'm gonna die. Like, what? Ew, okay, if she's gonna say she die, I have to look away. I can't watch this. Oh. I don't want to watch this. Ugh. Oh my god, I literally can't watch this. Girl, you I know you have no clue what you're even doing right now. Oh! That is sickening. But I also can't look away. Ah, yes I can, I can look away, I can look away. Alrighty, so we are done with episode 7. That episode was another kind of slower one but it was also I feel an important episode for Ellie's character because we got to learn a little bit more about her backstory we kind of learned some more about her um her sexuality too and then um yeah we didn't see much of Joel this episode but I think that I don't think that was really that much of an issue at least for me watching I I was fine with um that because um I mean, I just, I feel like this was important for Ellie as a character, because, yeah, she's, like, the main character, but also I think Joel is, and I, don't, I think we know more about Joel's backstory than we do Ellie, because we met this show through Joel 20 years ago, you know what I'm saying? And then it kind of progressed, and he's just, you know, we haven't really seen much of Ellie previous to the first episode we watched, so. Um, I think it would have been interesting if, in this episode, they kind of did where... The girl died and then Ellie like just never like she kind of realizes she's immune at some point um, but I'm assuming from what I'm assuming is they get caught by like either Marlene or someone because somehow they had to have known she was immune you know what I'm saying like I feel like she wouldn't turn herself in but I don't know I could be wrong um, however this happened. I kind of wish they showed that, honestly. I would have actually loved to have seen that. Um, but, yeah, overall, I, this was a solid episode. Um, I think it was a more important episode than, um, than it was action-packed, I guess is the word I'm trying to say. Like, sometimes an episode that doesn't have much action is more interesting to me than an episode with you know, I, I don't even know if I worded that right. An episode that's kind of slower and more, tells you more about the characters is more interesting than an episode where there's a bunch of action. Um, was my favorite episode of the show? No, it wasn't. But it was still, it was still a good episode. Like, I, I'm happy with this episode. I, I still enjoyed it. So, let me know what you guys thought down in the comments below of what you thought about this episode with getting to learn more about Ellie and meeting this new character. Um, unfortunately, I actually don't remember her name whatsoever, <laughs> but, um, nonetheless, still a very, very good episode, um, and yeah, I'm so excited, we only have two episodes left now, like, what is gonna happen in the next two episodes? Somehow, Joel's gotta get back on his feet, I feel like, and then, I, I genuinely, I have no clue what they have in store for the next two episodes, or what they could even do, like, it's, I fear that these next two episodes are gonna be quite insane, so, but I'm ready to watch it. I'm ready for this insanity to pick up a little. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please feel free to like, share, comment, and subscribe if you're interested in full-length reactions to this episode or any other show I react to. The link to my Patreon is down below. And, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode.